to update your firmware, you're gonna need a laptop, camera, and SD card. So first thing you'll have to do, you'll have to put the card inside the camera, turn your camera on, and uh, you will have to format the card using your camera. So go to menu, click OK, Zignask and click Yes. Okay, format is complete. The second thing you'll have to do, you'll have to check your firmware version. Scroll all the way down, click OK, and as you can see, the firmware is 1.02. So now we'll have to go to this website and I'll put a link in the description below. Right here, enter your product name. We're gonna put D5200. And click on a firmware. And we'll have to download D5200 version 1.03. That's the newer version that I have on a camera. And at the same time, we're also gonna update the distortion control data. So we're gonna download this one first. Click on the view download page. Windows, if you're doing on Windows, if you're doing on a Mac computer, then click on that. Scroll down, accept terms and conditions, and click download. Save. Once it's done, go to your download folder. Right click on it and uh, unzip your file or extract here. Then what you're gonna have to do, you're gonna have to transfer this .bin file to your SD card. Just copy this file and paste it or move it into the root directory of your SD card. And right click on it and eject. Okay, now you'll have to insert your card into your Nikon camera. And this method is actually gonna work on uh, every Nikon camera. Go to menu, firmware version, and now you're gonna see update option. Click OK and click yes. Make sure you don't turn your camera off, otherwise you're gonna break your camera. This process could take up to a few minutes. Okay, looks like it's done. Turn your camera off, turn it back on, go back to your menu, and go ahead and format your card one more time. Okay, turn your camera off. Go ahead, insert your memory card into your laptop or desktop, whatever you're using. And we'll go back to this page. Go back one more time and we're gonna download distortion control data. Same thing, scroll down. Accept terms and conditions, download, save. Go to the download folder, right click on it, extract here. And same thing, copy this file to your SD card.
go back to your camera. Turn your camera on. Go to menu, firmware version, update. You see right now it's saying 2.002. We'll update to 2.017, so to a newer version. Click yes. And same thing, could take up to a minute. Actually, this one did it very quick. Turn your camera off. You can turn it back on. Go to menu again. Click firmware version. As you can see, your firmware and the Starship control data is up to date. And this method should work on every Nikon camera. Doesn't matter, I did previously on the D3200 and this is D5200. And exactly the same way.